Hello, welcome to my bathroom. We are dyeing my hair pink. I should probably close the window. I'm doing it myself, which I've never dyed my hair before. Uh, so this could go really bad. But, you know, it's like pink. It washes out pretty quick, I'm sure. Hopefully. I have this Lunar Tides. Uh, cruelty free hair dye and this one is in pink petal that is what I'm using to dye my hair and then you know I'm gonna dilute it with cheap conditioner so <laughs> I couldn't find like a bowl that I could throw away so I'm using a takeout container to mix it this is gonna be the jankiest freaking video of your entire life for some extra protection we have a penguiny towel, just you know, to support me, um, make me think that I'm making the right decisions in my life, which I'm clearly not. Um, questionable, but I thought we would just do it together because I need somebody to validate my decisions. Uh, I decided I would, you know, document this horrible experience. And, I mean, it's great. Like, I'm excited about it. Like, the whole point, I'm, I know I'm being, like, sarcastic and everything, but, like, I've been wanting to dye my hair for a long time. So, this is a fully educated decision. I've watched, like, three tutorials, so I know what I'm doing. Uh, section off my hair. Gloves. Gloves are important. I just forgot about those. Okay. We're going in. Uh -oh. That's really pink. That's like, it's like a purpley pink, which I like. I think it's gonna be pretty. Oh, it actually smells good. You know, a lot of hair dye, because I have dyed my sister's hair plenty of times. Um, so I kind of get the process of it. But usually I get high off the fumes. Like it's so horrible that I just want to leave about one third in so the fact that i can smell this and it's amazing is crazy directions on this say wash and towel dry your hair apply an even layer with tint brush i don't have a tint brush um leave on for 35 minutes rinse with cold water without shampoo I have no idea how much is gonna cover my entire head so i think i'm just gonna go in with the conditioner first and like start pumping it in. I love that I'm doing this in a takeout box. Like, this is just freaking ridiculous. I have this much in my little container, so hopefully that works out. Uh, maybe it's too much, maybe it's too little. I have no fucking clue. That's what it's looking like now. Thinking a little bit darker. All right, we are ready to apply it to my hair. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. This is the underneath anyways, so if it turns out shitty, Whatever. I watched Jenna Marbles' video where she dyed her hair red recently, and I was like, you know what? That's great. I want to do that. Let's let's do that to my hair. I mean, I already had the idea to do my hair pink for a while, but uh, that just solidified it, you know? We're just applying this unevenly into my hair. I kind of have a feeling that my whole neck is going to be pink for, like, a while. I'm wondering how many sections I should actually do. Maybe, like, three? Time for the next section! This method where there is no method. I'm just going in. I'm just going ham. So, I was going to put on makeup, but then I realized that's some bullshit because literally I'd be putting on makeup just to dye my hair and I don't care enough. I feel like I had all these intentions of like what I was going to talk about and I was going to update you on everything and then I just started doing it and I realized how like focused I have to be to actually do this because I'm not skilled so uh you know talking and doing my hair at the same time is very difficult. Yes, since I've been back I kind of updated people on Snapchat, but if you don't follow me, it's Vanessa is a wolf, so. 
But anyways, I was mentioning on there that I've just been cleaning. I've been cleaning everything imaginable. Uh, just because my room, my bathroom was a goddamn mess and I couldn't take it anymore. It's driving me nuts. So I went into like crazy Vanessa cleaning mode, which does not happen often. There's a reason it was messy. Every so often she comes out and she's not happy. I used to tell myself like the reason I don't like cleaning is because I do it at my job. And then I just realized, no, Vanessa, you're lazy as fuck. Also, my dad said he was coming home with pizza, and I'm really excited about it. Well, all of it is covered now. Now is just, do I want to add more? Ah! Like, what do you guys think? Does it look okay? Does it look fucked? probably looks fucked, uh, let's be real. I've gone through about half of this so far, which I feel like, this isn't a very big jar. I don't think it was that expensive. I think it was like 12 bucks or something, and then with shipping it was like 15. Um, it did take about maybe a week and a half to get to me. It's from Etsy. I'll link it down below if you're interested. Okay, my hair is up. I'm gonna wait about 30 minutes, you know, probably eat some dinner, and I'll come back to you with a final result! Let's see if it actually works. <laughs> So I just washed it out and I definitely see some color which is great um, but I'm still unsure on how it's gonna look once it's dry. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Believe it or not I actually fell asleep last night so this is the next day. My sleeping schedule has been just messed up since I got back from New York. I want to disclaim that this is actually like not the color that I did yesterday so I ended up going in and dyeing like the upper part of my hair again because it just wasn't very opaque so I ended up using the entire thing of this I think because it was the first time that I've ever dyed my hair I used way too much conditioner the first time and you know it makes my hair feel really nice actually it's very deep conditioned uh, so you know that was a bonus but there's no reason to use that much conditioner. <laughs> I used about like one third of that and only did the top half of my hair because realistically like the bottom part isn't really going to get that pink. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I think it's kind of cute. I know that it's most likely going to wash out really quickly uh, just because pink doesn't stay in your hair. I did end up picking up this overtone pink conditioner and I'm hoping that this will kind of keep the color. It does look like a different color of pink, so that's like a really bright pink compared to this one, which is more purpley. I did read some reviews on it and people said that it can make your hair feel kind of stripped and stringy, so I'm going to try to use another conditioner with it at the same time. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'll give you updates on you know, how it's working out. Um, probably on Instagram or something because that's where I usually post like daily. So if you're not following me on my Instagram, it's Vanessa is a wolf. And yeah, this is the final hair. Should I, should I do a back view or something? I don't know. I'm not professional, you guys. <laughs> um, all right. That is what it looks like from the back. It did make the upper part of my hair look pretty orange, which some people don't like. Personally, it's not an issue for me. I, d I don't really care. Do you like me with pink hair? Do you think it's cute? I think it's cute. You know, like a little summertime vibe kind of thing. If you, you know, like these more chilled out kind of videos, press the subscribe button so you see when I make new videos. I hope you're having a great day, and until next time, bye.